I work at Wetherspoon Organic. Um, we produce honey and my role is the processing and the filtration of that honey and also the fixing and maintenance of the packing line which is semi-automated. So I studied mechanical engineering because I really enjoyed taking things apart as a kid, all that sort of stuff. I like the building and understanding how things work. My family's always been around like farming and outdoor stuff, but I'm kind of the first one to ever get into the engineering side of things and the building and making of stuff. The world is going to head towards a lot of automation of manual labour. Any easy tasks will just be done automatically. So it's the design and the control of that automation and the management of that automation, that's where the time and effort will be, that and the creative kind of arts. So when it comes to engineering, if you're working with machinery, you're working with automation and design and management of those machines and keeping those machines up and running. We buy local honey. Some of it comes from up north, but most of it's from central or upper South Island. We buy it off local apiaries and we bring it into our warehouse. From there we melt it out because it's all solidified. We melt it and then tip it into our tip tank and run it through our filtration skid. From there we pump it into our big tanks and we cream it so that it, it creates tiny crystals and then it makes a smooth honey and will stay that way for a long time so it's got a really long shelf life. We pump it into jars and label it and pack it into pellets and then we ship it over to the States. I think engineering gives you a curiosity about the world wanting to understand how things work and from that curiosity it kind of inspires you to learn more.